Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to get your MP3 player or your USB drive or whatever to automatically open when you plug it into your computer. So what you want to do is go to, uh, depending on the computer you've got, you can click on um, search, just type in here control panel, go to control panel, then go to auto play, you want to click on that, left click once, then up the top here, you want to make sure that this is ticked, use auto play for all media and devices, so make sure that that's ticked, then you want to come down to where it says removable drive and here you want to click on that little arrow and click on here open folder to view files. Once you've done that click save down here and when you plug in your mp3 player or your USB drive it will automatically open when you plug it in so you will see it on the screen okay that's one way you can do it the other way is you can when you plug in your mp3 player or whatever you can go up here to actually this is normally down the bottom so I'll see if I can move it for you so normally that's down the bottom like that so what you, what you can do is you can go to computer so you click on that little manila folder down here, click on that and in this list here you will see when you plug it in a new one will appear here which I will show you, I will give you an example, so I will plug in something now just give me two secs, sorry about the delay, let me just plug in a removable device So now you can see here, I've just plugged in a removable device which just has pictures on it or something, I don't know. So that's how you, um, two ways that you can access data on an MP3 player or a USB drive. Hope you enjoyed this video and I hope it was helpful. Um, you can subscribe if you like, I don't really, it's up to you, I don't mind. Um, but this was in, in reply to someone who um, asked me a question because she plugs in her MP3 player and uh, nothing happens because obviously someone's turned off autoplay. She says uh, that it only charges. But also some devices um, actually require permission. For instance, if you plug your phone in, a little message will appear on your phone that will say, will you allow this device to access your phone? But it only appears once. And you've got to pretty quickly tap, yes, allow this device to access my phone. So, or it might, it might actually appear on your um, computer screen. It might say, do you want to allow this device to access your computer? So, um, but I'm pretty sure that only happens once. And if you don't, click on OK at, at that time, um, you probably, or you may not see that message again. It depends on the hardware, it depends on the equipment, you know, all computers and all um, phones and mobile devices are different in the way they act, but usually they require permission. It's all, all for security reasons, so. Anyway, so I hope that helps, guys. Um, yeah, just subscribe and like if you like. I don't, you know, whatever. <laughs> All right, take it easy. Bye.